Hey team, good morning. It is Jason Patterson here with Macro Millionaire and we have special guest Rachel Ferguson in the house today. We are super excited to have her in for this interview. Uh, she is a newly added coach that has joined our Business Pro program. And uh, we're just doing this. We wanna, we wanna talk a little bit about Rachel, find out a little bit about her story and you know, just uh, why nutrition coaching is what she decided to uh, to pursue. So Rachel, we'll jump right into it. Why don't you just, uh, if you don't mind, tell us a little bit about yourself, just a little bit about your story and, and why you became a coach. Hi guys, great to meet everyone and get a chance to have this opportunity. Thank you, Jason and Jesse and Macro. Um, I became a coach. I've been coaching for almost 20 years. Um, I'm a physical therapist by practice and walking beside people and helping them move to the best version of themselves from a physical standpoint has just been natural for me. And so coming on and adding macro and getting a deeper dive into their health from a nutrition perspective just seemed automatic. And so it was just natural fit to move into a deeper look at how nutrition can be a piece to that healing process. Awesome. Yeah, I love that. Um, I, that I love that answer. Um, you know, for me, just kind of transitioning into the next question. For me, when I personally came in, I wasn't taught about an ideal client. Now, you being somebody that's a seasoned vet, 20 years of coaching under your belt, coming in and utilizing the system, you probably have more of a a specific person that you like to work with. Why don't you tell me a little bit about your ideal client, you know, who you who you feel you can help the most? You know, Jason, that's a great question. And being in the world of physical therapy, I've had the opportunity to work in what's called an outpatient setting. So I had all ages from young kids to senior citizens. But I think the biggest passion I have is those individuals that feel like because their life is busy and um, you know, they can't find time to fit in anything. They're chasing kids, they're moving into the business world. And so I would say the ideal is that kind of mid thirties to early sixties where they start to just say, I don't have time for me. And I love to show them how it can just take five minutes. It can just take a half an hour and it can be a piece that they can take in and easily make it part of any setting that they're in. And so that 35 to 60, I'm not okay with them just saying, well, I'm okay hurting. I must just have arthritis. I'm old. Well, the reality is their body is still not falling apart. It's just managing the time that they have to learn little pieces of taking care of themselves and putting themselves first in the day can actually start to make them feel better. And that goes from the nutrition that they put in themselves to physically how they start to move and drink water. So. It's kind of that middle world that kind of gave up that said, oh, now I'm just down the slippery slope of getting too old and I'm going to hurt. Perfect. I love it. Yeah. You know, I see that a lot too. You know, just those folks that kind of just throw in the towel. It used to come mm -hmm. so easy to them. And now we got to put in a little bit of work, maybe, maybe build a little bit of awareness, develop a few new habits, but you're exactly right. Sometimes it only takes that five minute conversation to help them understand that. So yeah, I love that. Good yeah. deal. Good deal. So. Last thing here on the uh, on the kind of interview side before we talk a little bit more about you, why Macro Millionaire? What stuck out with you about this program that you were like, yep, this is for me. You know, you had 20 years of coaching experience already. So what was it that stuck out about Macro Millionaire that, yeah, that made you just, let's go? Yeah, you know, that that's a great question. And the biggest thing that stuck out to me is the pieces that I, actually already implemented in my day to day with helping people walk through their healing is starting to get them to break down how much they need to hydrate themselves, how much they need to take in the right nutrients, how much they need to sleep. And a lot of those pieces were being shown in all of the pictures that were coming through of team members posts. And it was just things that I used to, and I'm not an artist, would you know, stick man draw out for my clients were in nice, really good looking pictures. And that's what I like about macro. The system has been built and it's very clean and very clear on how you can jump in, get involved. And there's a process that will help you grow, but then it's also easy that everybody can work together and clean professional looking images that us novices at art 
have to draw stick figures to get that same kind of visibility out there. So it was just natural to see, you know, this was already a piece that was a part of me. But again, you guys were doing much better at organizing it and getting clear, professional looking pictures out there that awesome. people could learn from. Yeah, awesome. No, thank you. Thank you so much for that. I, I absolutely couldn't agree with you more. I love what Jesse's done as far as just the, the crisp, polished, you know, white labeled material that is out there that, that we can utilize for our own businesses. I, I fell in love with the same thing when I came through as well. So, yeah, definitely. So, kind of transitioning into a, a little more about you on a personal level you know when we when we start these things and you know for me personally starting a business it's scary for anybody but what would you say scared you the most getting started and how are you overcoming that or how did you overcome that you know that's a good question jason um i, I think as someone willing to step out to start a business you kind of have to have that little adrenaline rush you kind of like to have a new challenge and i love challenges Probably my biggest fear is I'm really good at taking on too many challenges. And so as I brought macro into my learning environment and wanted to add it to my toolbox, I also started a brick and mortar building. And so at this, at all of it came together is me taking on a lot of activities at once. And so that was my biggest fear is um, jack of many trades, master of none of my trades. Um, yes. And so probably my biggest battle is learning to, I, I, it is completely what's needed. I feel called that it's a piece that I need to grow in. Um, and again, will benefit all of my clients. Um, but I have to continue being self-aware and making sure that I walk within that. Um, why is that fear there and how I'm partnering with other people? So to get through that fear, I've partnered with, again, Macro has an amazing group of coaches that will mentor and walk with you. Um, and it's just keeping yourself accountable, making sure you have clear tasks and then just taking it one day at a time. So I have to have a process for myself to keep myself channeled in the right direction that I can awesome. keep growing, that I can keep my help for my clients keep grow. Keep yeah, growing. absolutely. Absolutely. I love that. I love that. You're, you're spot on when you say that. That's one thing that a lot of people take for granted. You know, they think, oh, I've got the title. I'm going to go out here. I'm going to be that coach. And they stop growing. They're content yeah. with that. And right. you're spot on when you say that about personal growth and just continuing to develop. And that kind of moves into that next question then, you know, so I'm going to ask you a little bit. Tell me about some current success, you know, whether it's whether it's personal growth, financial growth, client success, you know, what do you feel that level of impact is? You know, how have you been able to grow? Um, you know, even over the 20 years that you've been in business and then once Macro Millionaire came into your life, you know, how have you used that to to transition into that? Uh, that's great, Jason. You know, the biggest thing with this program is my growth has been getting even a clearer process in place. How do I start my day? Where does it begin? And what's the plan that I've got to roll out? Because without the structure, in a way to the day, I can't make sure that the structure is happening for my clients. Um, but with that, I mean, I've got had to get very clean because again, I took on many things at once again, trying to grow myself and I've got to make sure that I get clean how I start my day. But immediately um, I went through some bumps in the road with this whole process of learning and taking it all on at the same time. I've had a client just reach out with, to me in the last week and I've been walking with her for the last year um, and she has lost 50 pounds and she said, I'm not even worried about the number anymore. She said, what has changed inside of me and how I've found that I'm happier with myself has led her to look at thinking bigger on job opportunities and thinking bigger on how she can invest in her kids and where she was running nonstop, um, busy mom, two kids oldest just graduated from high school in this middle of the pandemic and where she was running stressed all the time she now stops and it, she's created her process for the day yes. that she actually has stopped stressing over a number and starting to realize how she can actually find peace and then help other people so it, it's just amazing at trying to clean my process up has also just helped share that people have also had a bigger picture clean theirs up and they can find peace in the middle of it. 
isn't it amazing how that stress level just kind of as it drops things get so much easier all the way around you know whether, yep. whether it's losing weight whether it's just being in business and communicating and trusting people it, i mean i'm the same way you know that stress level used to be up here and now it's just one that i just let it let it live down here yeah it's down there every now and yeah. again and it may be a spike every occasionally but you know it just once you learn how to develop that process and put it into place into your daily life the effect it can have not only on yourself but on so many others it's just it's so impactful i love it yeah so so rachel last thing here so obviously we stand behind holistic wellness services we stand behind you as a coach you are impacting so many lives every day you're a seasoned vet, been in it for 20 years, you know, going to continue to push and pursue. If somebody at home is watching this right now and they want to contact you, what is the best way to get a hold of you? Tell us a little bit, you know, social media platform. I know you're local here to central Indiana. How can they get a hold of you and, and your services? You know, Jason, I'd love anybody to call me. I'm just a phone call or a text away. Um, you can reach me at 765-860-9220. You can check out the website. It's www.holistic-wellness-services.com. And you can take a look at all the options. I partner with a lot of coaches here um, in the area too to do a variety of activities. Um, holistic is mine as physical therapy and the nutrition coaching side. Um, but you can get a hold of us through that website. Perfect. Perfect. Well, thank you so much. And thank you for Thanks, taking Jason. the time today to go through the interview as well. So guys, this is Jason Patterson, Rachel Ferguson. We are signing off and we will see you all soon. Have a thank great you day. All. Have, a, have a blessed day.